Is this the leech's work? Yeah. New corpses every day. If you are the only target for your people's fear, then they will turn on you. They're scared. If I am to be redeemed, I owe them the leech. How many bodies is that now? A score have been uncovered. Definitely the leech's work. How can you be sure? Their eyes are scooped out. Black, empty caverns. Same as Trigger's gods. Must be hundreds of people passing by here each day. Anyone see them dumped? It's the riverbank, Winner. Every crooked dealing in this city goes through here. Heard from Stowe yet? About the arrow? The leech is my focus just now. Does something worry you? Ah, no, just checking up on the old sparrow heart. You two are close, like brothers. Yeah, yeah. Close like brothers, you could say. Erke! Tell me he wasn't hurt! It wasn't your daughter, dear Kida. Take a breath. Oh, thank Freya. I have such a fear I will find her down here. She works errands for a smith who sends her to these docks. Most times at night. I cannot stand it. She works for a blacksmith. Do you know where? Never told me his name, nor where he hammers. Tight-lipped about everything, this stubborn girl. I haven't seen her in two days, and feared the worst. In London, you must always fear the worst. What sort of job did she have? Ran errands and the like. She would make a delivery, trade it for hack silver, and scurry back to her smithy. Do you know the name of the man? Name. But I wish I did. I would box his ears and harvest his nuts. Anything else you remember? I had a neighbor once tell me she saw Regna, lingering for a time under the London Bridge. Worried me sick hearing that. That is a good place to start. Thank you, Gila. A shady smith, a missing child. It's a lead with some weight. London Bridge after sundown. It's worth a look. Good. I'll hang about here and keep things calm. And Eivor, don't drop your guard around these docks. Do I look like one who could? Follow him. See where this leads. Can this clod walk any faster?
You got the purse I'm out, huh? Who the fuck are you? I'm a friend, Doya. Your money is with your lad. What have you to do with him? I'm keeping him safe. He was being followed. Tch, I knew he was soft. Not like my other girl. She was hard as hog's breath, that one. What happened to her? Fell ill a few days back. So I sent her to good Sister Friedeswith, healer in town. Sister Friedeswith? Got broken bones, a boil on your bum, or too much birth blood? She'll mend you quick. She would need a broad set of tools for such work. She would, and she has it. Comes to me for all her wants, and I craft for her what she needs. Not anymore, you don't. Your worm food! Cut your corpse! Raise my hood here.
This is where the leech dissects her prey. One more, that's all. I'm nearly finished. That is enough. Oh, it's you. For all the dead we collect, dear sister, you and I are equals. Quite a charm, house. I I'd lost count of how many. I suppose I've been greedy in my research, but not for lack of care. The ancient ones. The Arbiters. They built us out of simple pieces. So easy to break. So difficult to mend. There must be an improvement. We should be stronger. Faster. Smarter. I could have fixed us. I could have made us better. We are blood and bone and spirit, Frida Swift. Perfect as we are. You've such beautiful eyes. Finish it. Would you? It is done. Ah! The leech is blared out. And did you catch a name? A nun. Name of Frida Swift. What? The good sister? That can't be right. She was a saint. A healer and a... <laughs> God! That brick fits this week's wall of shit. You knew her? She saved me. Mended the broken leg. Thought I'd lose it. But not with Frida's way. You wouldn't know it was ever broken. The sands will run backwards now. Without her, we'll return to balancing humors. All of that for this. Secrets of the human form. How she saved lives. And how she ended them. It might be... Not every problem has a clean solution. True. Very true. I've built my name selling the hard fix. 
I'll live with it. This was her fix. All her ideas and discoveries written here. Ill-gotten gains. I have a mind to burn that bloody tome. Is that the right call? It has cures for everything, from boils to broken bones. It is worth keeping. We fight wars to save those we love, and pay in blood for what we win. This book, this is your good sister's battlefield, her kingdom. You may be right. We can't return the dead to life, but their sacrifice can mean something. If you need me, I'll be at St. Paul searching for something on the compass. Thanks for all this, Broca. Welcome to the West Market. A lawman like you could set folks on edge in a square like this. Why not wear a cloak? Hide my face? Not a chance. It does the people good to see a lawman on the hunt. You and Erke found the identity of the leech. Some holy healer. She was called Frida Swiss. Had an appetite for eyes. If this order can corrupt London's favored saint, what hope do we have? The noise yet about the arrow and recruits. I've heard whispers. Somewhere here, a man gives you a coin, and this coin grants you entry to a contest run by the Arrow's men. Which man? I see too many here. He's good at blending in. I haven't spotted him yet today. I will sniff around. You stay back. Eivor, what was your impression of Erke? You suspect him of something? I don't know. Whoever killed Trigo was a close friend, and... It was Erke who found the body. I know Erke so well, and I can't bear to think you'd do something so vile. But... Then do not. Wait for proof before you condemn your friend. Ah, forgive me. My latest thoughts have been restless. I've been a reeve for so long. Fighting for God's justice. I shed my earthly attachments for his great plans. But, but you could not shed Erke and his friendship. No. No, I'm not sure I could. It is good to talk, unburden your soul. Clears the mind and lifts the weight off the chest. Yes, indeed. And thank you for listening. I should find one of these coins soon. Will you be around? I'll return to St. Paul's just down the road. Godspeed, Eivor. Is that the coin for the archery contest? Keep off. This is a This coin is engraved with an image of the London Coliseum. In a distinct place. What's your business? Shooting or watching? You are looking for skilled archers. Now you have found one. This contest is private. Invitation only. Your men are handing out these coins like they were on fire. Is this enough? It's enough to keep us talking. But I'll want to see how well you handle that bow before you go any further. Want a trial round to test your eye? I've had enough practice. A real fanatic you are. Here. Hit all targets true before the sand runs down. Here's the new competitor, a Norse from the northern wilds of Mercia. And our current reigning champion, Sayed! All right, take your mark. Hook set, arrows north, fire! Deadly aim you have. Best 
have seen for some time. Well shot! You have earned your place at the Arrow's side today. He'll be eager to meet you. Pull yourself to the Imperial Arch and speak with our man, Husa. Recite the phrase. May the Father of Understanding guide us, and he'll know it's you. <laughs> Are you Husa? Yeah. And who's asking? May the Father of Understanding guide us. And may the Mother of Wisdom give us strength. You're to stand just there, look your best when the arrow comes forth, and keep still. Friends! Brethren! Good people of London! We have had... a hard week. Cowardly invaders! stole into our governor's home and robbed him of his life. Trigger, my friend, my leader, slaughtered like a dog by outsider. It's a hard thing to raise the rats of a city into warriors. Hook set! You raised no one. You only trapped them in their cowering fear. Draw strings! First wave fire! No. I gave these men order. I gave them purpose. I showed them their common enemy. Anchor strings! Second wave fire! I was arrow for their rage. Without a foe to consume, we devour ourselves. He speaks true. A man without an enemy defeats himself. Justify all you want. You're just a king killer and a coward. Mighty high horse. You'd do the same if you were me. Aim and fire! To God. It will take more than a few lads with newly polished bows to fell me. The arrow was a boy. A man with a boy's brain called Avgus. Avgus? I can't be right. I could return with his head on a spear if you would like to see. No. You've no reason to lie. Yet Avgus, my old friend, had no cause to murder. He saw London as a kiln of rage. To harden the softness of its younger men. Perhaps I ignored in him what I hoped not to see. Ambition. Greed. Anger. From one man, such hatred is easy to spot. But from many, it is a fog that fills the room. Power. Men will claw for it and cling to it at the cost of everything. Very true. And it is cold comfort when glory has the taste of your family's blood. Two targets down. Only the compass remains. If it were my men killed, I would be on my way to London now. The compass will come, and we must be ready. 
expecting the worst. I do not want anyone catching me off guard. Could we take the fight to him? There may be a way. Let's regroup in the church when you've had time to rest, Broker. Guards. You hear me, okay? Her blood's on you! It's a ruse, I tell you! Some surly guests outside. Eivor, we were... Uh, we, we didn't see you enter. Have you stepped out today? There's a strange feeling brewing in the streets. I've heard the shouts. The deaths of Abgors and Friesweed have angered many. Let us hope the compass numbers among the offended. I don't doubt it, but are we ready for him? It is time we focused on the compass. Gather all we know. Aye. We let fly the feather dart. Cut raven ink from a cowering quill. Now we wait, wolf tensed, for the master of the river rep to return and revenge his shaken warriors. Well, well, this one's got the gift of all its meat. What is on your mind, Stowe? We know the compass is a sailor, a captain from Francia. And he won't like hearing he's got a leak in his hull, so to speak. With the death of the leech and the arrow, you want to hit back, but we can't know how or when. Apart from this, the man's invisible. Coward, if you ask me. Burn in your hell, you bloody reeves! We're pinned in! Is there another way out? The tower! There's an open window they can't have reached! I'll go up! You find a way out!
I had a view of the city from the roof. There's a new flotilla in the harbor. A compass, bastard. If we commandeered the Springlands at Avgosport, we could rain a cloud of arrows on the invaders. I'd sooner take the flank and go around this army to the boats. If we cut the head off this beast, the Order's men will be easy to rout. I will go my own way. Less danger to you both. Whatever happens, this ends tonight. May God guide our swords and cover our backs. Don't be reckless, little boys. We'll see you when it's done, Hirke. Count on it. Can't hold out much longer. <laughs> Burning to ash what you cannot possess, that is a child's way out. To hell with London. Boudicca was right to burn it to the ground. It's a brick and mortar shithouse. So bright and beautiful set aflame. Will you rule over these cinders now? Yoke its people to your whims and needs? You do have power here. Power you have earned. I have finished my work in London. That is enough. <laughs> London is only a beginning. My order reaches further than your tiny boats can take you. Never forget, Trigger, my old friend. A man at sea may have gold and glory. But he is always a slave to the churning tides. We are that time.
There you are. The drinker we must thank for our good fortune. How do I look? Half drowned and half burnt? Not half of either. And far better for the blood on your blade. The compass is dead. London is yours to wreck or rebuild. We will rebuild. We'll strengthen the walls, reunite families, and likely use less wood, more stone. <laughs> Ill-timed, Erke. I'd like a quiet moment to pray. We'll take it together. Until our next meeting, I trust you will heed my call if I should send for you. You came to London in search of a friend, Eivor. You found two. Aye, Broga. And you deserve this. A silver ring for your raven perch. It was Trickers before he gifted it to me. I say you've earned the right to wear it now. I'm touched, Erke. I will carry it with pride. Seems the wind calls me back to Rantvi. Let's tell her the good news. The order has been purged from London. That is good news. And I would celebrate, but for the fact that your... Jarvik is a city under Norse control. I should have less problems finding allies there. That is a hopeful way of seeing it. Speak to Ranvi when you wish to travel there. Do you need something? What... When you eliminate it... I have to go. Then go in peace. You look well. London is with us, and cleansed of the Order. Good. Hytham will be pleased. I should speak with Hytham. I want to see the Alliance map. Tell me about Jorvik. Hytham says there are three more targets there. If that is true, you are in luck. Our old friends Jor and Ljuvina have made their homes in Jorvik. Both had status and influence in Norway, so they may have valuable insights into the city's politics. That would make my work easier. What say you, then? I will go now. Do you know where I might find Hjor and Lufina? When entering a new city, it is best to ask around the ports. 
the people there know more than the average peasant. I have something here for you. Tidings that may displease you. Tell me. You remember Kyotve's son, Gorm? He has since taken his father's place in the Order. Interesting. He's got him here in England. Is he another bludge on our list? He is one of our targets, yes. But he is not in England. He is further west, in fact. A land called Vinland, discovered centuries ago by an Irish sailor called Brendan. The Order of the Ancients has some recent fascination with Vinland, but I cannot say what it might be. Let me find out for you. After I silence Gorham. Vinland is far away, according to my source. It may take weeks to find him after a long and perilous journey. There is no danger that would cow me, Hytham. I will speak with Ranvi and arrange passage. Was there something else? I have to go. Then go in peace. What happened? Are they still in danger? Not if we get there soon. Which way now? This way. We're almost there. You have to tell me what has happened. I can't. You won't understand. Even if I do, just, just trust me. What is this about? Sorry, Eivor. We had to trick you. But it wasn't my idea. It was Iris. Lying is not a good way to get my attention, children. But we found a dog that needs your help. She's caught in a trap down there. We thought you wouldn't come if you knew it was just a dog. Oh. That is not the sound of a dog, Ira. That is a wolf. But a wolf is a kind of dog, yes? My mother told me that. Of course, it's a kind of a dog. Listen to that sound. Awoo! Pure dog. Eivor, if you won't help us free her, we must do it ourselves. There's no need. Let me see what I can do. We must help her. She could be starving. Poor her. She's crying. We have to help. Her family probably misses Be my eyes, Sunan. Keys in the front door. I must be cautious opening it. I'll free that wolf. I'm afraid to tear that I needn't slay it in front of the children. The table is set. He never made it home. At least his end came quickly. Easy. Easy. You have a kind look to you. I think the man liked his trophies. At least he leaves that legacy. Wait, wait, easy now! Deceived by children and shouting at wolves. I was a warrior once.
Are you all right? Did you see the wolf? Yes, you freed her. You're amazing, Eivor. But she ran away and didn't even say thank you. She's going back to her family, maybe. Her mom and dad were probably very scared. Or her wolf husband. Maybe her wife. We don't know. But we do know it is time to get you three back to the settlement. Before your parents think you were eaten by wolves. Oh, all right. Chin up, Knut. You were very brave today. All of you. In future, you should not be exploring the woods alone, you understand? But you go off on your own all the time. Because I am very wise. And you have a lot to learn. Yes, but there are three of us. That balances everything. That is not quite how it works. Stand back! Are you all right? Thanks to our hero, this dog wolf. The wolfka. What? The wolfka. It's like dog wolf. Oh, no, I don't like that at all. We should name her Mouse. That makes no sense. I think we should call her Chewy because she chews things. What do you think, Eivor? The Wolfka. It has an absurd sound, just like all of this. She's our best friend. Now we need to get home. All five of us. Fine. We only wanted to have an adventure like you, Eivor. And we did! And we got a new friend! Part of adventuring is learning a good lesson. Did you know that? Yes, the boring part. Well, have you children learned anything about wild animals today? Hmm, maybe. Yes, befriend them at any cost. They are perfect companions and very kind. My mother always told me to avoid wild animals. Shows what she knows. How about Lee and what we have learned? Just until we get home? I think she's quite fond of you. I know she is. We saved her. She'd be rotting away by now. Just like that boar you killed, Eivor. You saw that? We Let's not everything. tell your parents, all right? Now scamper off home and take your new friend with you. Nice. I want to see the alive. Have you spoke with Hytham about Vindland? I have. Good. I have marked it on the map with a bit of guesswork as to its location. Let me know when you wish to leave. What can you tell me of Vindland? Is it a real place or merely a rumor? Rumor or not, I found someone willing to sail you there. She claims to have seen it once before. If she is willing to risk her life beside me, and make the long journey, I will take her at her word. Nessa is her name. Meet her at the docks when you are ready to leave. I will go now, and end the life of Goran Kjotvison where the Valkyries cannot find him. It is a long voyage, Eivor. Be careful. Good day to you, stranger. Nessa, is it? I'm Eivor. Randri said you would be my guide. That is right. Passage to across the seas to St. Brenton's land, is that right? Randri called it Vinland. One and the same. 
It is a three-week trip by longship. Arduous, dull, possibly fatal. Should we survive, you will be compensated. Eivor, before you go, you must be dressed as a thrall when you arrive. To be seen as you are would raise suspicions. Gorm runs this new camp, and it is a good bet all but a few will be loyal to him. Good thinking. Only taking care of our prized Drenger. First things first, Eivor. My ship, my rules. Second, you follow the rules. Third, if you listen to my rules, you live. Understood. Good. Let me know when you're ready and we'll get going. I will leave my gear behind and dress the part. To Vinland we go. Hop in! We'll leave now! Three cold weeks in the whale road. Past mountains of ice and kingdoms of stone. Saga lands. All this way to kill a man. Gorum Kjotvison, the son of my father's old foe. What dark work does the Order have so far across the open sea? Someone in charge. I had better step with care. No friends here. You! You look stronger than most of the others. What's your name? Yora of Jorvik. Yora? As in horse? My father never wanted children. What is this place? Newhaven. A wild place found on no map. Are we settling here? That is not our plan. Too many wild folk in the woods. They threaten us? You ask too many questions, horse. Your task is to keep your mouth shut and do as I tell you. Now, unload that ship and then I'll have you carry those carrots. Hildi! 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 We can't find Olaf. Look, he's ours, not again. We cannot send supplies to Gorn without his guidance. Ugh! Pull what supplies we have to the nearest camps, then. Gorm's men will do the rest. Let me go. I can carry whatever supplies Gorm needs. That's Olaf's job, horse, not yours. You stick to this port and keep your head down. Ask around about Olaf. Someone must know where he has run off to. If I can find this Olaf, he may know where Gorm is. Nessa, is your ship headed for England? It is. Are you... No, I must yet perform a few... <sighs> Do not take... 